Well, first and foremost, all praises and glories unto Yahweh by Hashem Yahushai, by Hashem Arachakodash, double honors to the apostles and the elders of the great millstone and the elder bishops of the great millstone who teach and rule well. Greetings, salutations, blessings, and much love for you, uh, hopefully, like out there, Shalom. Best required with a quick video and just wanted to uh, bring this out because a friend of mine had asked me. How is it when we have conversations, I'm getting these, uh, basically stuff is popping up that, we're, that I'm talking about on my phone. Yeah, I, th I thought I opted out of turning my, um, you know, Google uh, or, or any of these uh, microphones listening. Because there's a setting that you can do that, but what's the purpose of it, right? Because watch what it says. Whatever with that. Anyway, it says, uh. Understand app privacy and security practices with Google's Play data safety section. Okay, and it says before you install an app from Google Play, you can check the app's data safety section. Now, the spirit of this was um, my phone had opened up in my pocket, you know, and then uh, and it just basically pocket dialed and brought this up, was trying to get me to add an app in my pocket. And so that's why I'm doing a video. It's also the spirit because it just popped up and gave me the idea from the conversation a friend and I had about stuff just popping up. But now, as we talked about it a day or two ago, this is now just popping up on my phone because apparently I pocket dialed or whatever to get it to this point where it pops up. So it's the spirit to just do the video. Anyway, it says, uh, before you install an app from Google Play, you can check the app's data safety section. Developers use the data safety section to share information about how their app handles your data. So your URL, every your IP address, and all of those different things, and the sites you look at, all of that's being recorded. Okay, all of that is being recorded. They're taking full... Um, um, track of of what you're looking at, okay, through your phone. You know everything, all your Instagrams, uh, the cooking recipes, whatever it is you're into, they're watching it, okay. All the heat Israelite videos, everything. This is all gonna play into something later. They're gonna develop um, a mind to 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 put you in in a, in a trick bag, basically. All right, it says um. I got one more after this. It says, uh, another script. It says, um, this way you can make more informed decisions about what apps you use. So it's giving you the ability to look at who's, um, we're not going to watch that. Because the point I want to make was, tell you how to do it. Um, yeah, down here, understand and review app data safety practices. The data safety section is an app list listing lets developers describe how their apps collect, share, and handle different types of data. And now if I were to click on the types of data, you know, they may or may not say that things picked up from your microphone. But we know that, that, that these things pick up from the microphone as well. Okay, same with these. Alexas and all these other, you know, stuff around on Siri and all of that. It, it listens. When you can say the words, hey, Google, and it just pop up, you telling me it's not listening? Okay. It was a developer explain how they uh, explain their practices for data collection. It says developer describe how types of data, of, excuse me, of user data their app collects how they use this data and whether the collection is of this data is optional they determine whether it's optional data is generally uh, considered collected when the developer uses the app to retrieve data off your device so it's only considered collected so they're, they're collecting it but it's only considered collected if they desire uh, uh, decide to retrieve the data off your device so it's being stored already somewhere but it's only considered collected when they 
when they go and see it or use it. It says, in some cases, <laughs> developers do not need to disclose data as collected, even if data technically technically leaves your device. For example, when the data is only processed ephemerally, <laughs> Learn more about these cases below. Data sharing. It's crazy, right? It said developers describe if their app shares your data with third parties and what types of data are shared. Data is generally considered shared when it is ex accessed by the app and transferred to a third party. It is, so why, why I was talking about you know, hypothetically, I was singing my Adidas, and then all of a sudden, my Run DMC, then all of a sudden, Adidas is, is giving me, um, you know, um, um, choices to, to, to buy Adidas shoes. You know? Like, this doesn't happen like that. Or you bring up a movie or a director or an actor, and now the next something with the minute pops up. And it's not just... In, uh, in advertisements, I mean, it pops up on your YouTube. I mean, this stuff comes around. Like, they, they, they your whole life now is beginning to reflect back with the things you say through your device. Okay? In the movie, um, I don't know if I did a review on it or not. Um, spiritual review, uh, Ex Machina. Um, in that movie... <coughs> Um, they, he, he pretty much told him that he collected all his searches from his search engine, just like everybody else does. They couldn't call him out on it because they would be, um, basically letting it be known that they did it themselves. All right. If they called him out on it, um, for example, if you give your consent to transfer the data after the app explains how it is used, how it will use the data, or when the data is shared with the developer's service provider. Now, if you can keep going, they're just telling you how they're gonna do it, and there's nothing you can do about it, basically. And and they just throw the option that well, we can use it and share it if we want to. We don't really have to tell you. Not everything we do is, is necessary, and it's true. But think about it. Most people just go ahead and confirm. And just keep going through it and just, just to get to what they're trying to get to. They got us so quickly about um the speed of what we were we're searching or whatever we're doing to the fact that now it's um more about the speed of it and getting to it and you agreeing to all kinds of things in this phone. Okay, but so the point was yes, they are listening. Now let me read this in Corinthians chapter two in the NLT. So that Satan will not outsmart us. Okay? For we are familiar with his evil schemes. Okay? We know that in the KJV. Let's see what we got under these schemes. All right, even advantage. Look at these words. There's always something good to do to go to. To have more or a greater part or share. To be superior. Advantage. He takes. He's superior over us. He's in rulership over us. Because he has all these schemes. So I can. Okay. To gain or take advantage of another. To overreach. Alright. To get an advantage. To fraud. Make a gain. Isn't that what he's doing? See if we can get a different word. Next word is uh and not for his schemes. No Emma, we did this before. Mental perception, thought, and evil purpose. Okay, that which thinks the mind, thoughts, or processes. Okay, the schemes. It's this man, man, a damn uh, uh, deceiver, man. A, a um, what's the other word? Wow. <clears throat> All right. 
So let's get another preset. All right. And so we got Revelation chapter 12. Now, this is important because what are they going to use this data for? What are they sharing this with? Eventually, they can use this to pass a little legislation just to make it seem like it's all all right. But they can just use this to say that this is a homegrown terrorist. To say that you're, you know, they can label a bunch of things. They're already saying you're putting out medical information. They already do the thing up there with uh, PayPal. Saying if you have uh, if you send some some misinformation on the on on online, they can go ahead and and take that you know take money out your account, showing you the system they're setting up, right? So Revelation uh, chapter twelve verse ten, uh, I read it in the NLT. It says, "Then I heard a loud voice shouting across the heavens. Uh, it has." come at last salvation and power in the kingdom of our power of our God and the authority of Hamashiach Yahushai. for the accuser of our brother, brothers and sisters has been thrown down um, the one who accuses them before our God day and night and when you're going to accuse they're going to accuse accuse us man falsely all right. Um, there's a word right there. Let's go to that word accuser. And this is what they have to do. If you notice, people don't treat treat you with um, individuality anymore. It's all about. And look at the word categorials, putting you in a category. Once they say, "Oh yeah, he hates white people. He's, uh, he's this, or he he hates this. He's that, or he likes this. He's that." Hey, Amen. You know, sometimes that's not the truth about an individual or, or a person, but the people have become so washed out, if you are, if if you will, meaning they're not teaching uh, the children of now and today. To be individuals, to have their own style and like, and, and and deal with the life that comes with being their own person. Everybody wants to fit in. Everybody gets a trophy, you know, just for participation trophies. Like this is social acceptance. It doesn't matter what gender. It doesn't matter what all of that. Okay, to where there's no individual, but they try to push individualism. With with, with when it comes to gender. Okay, you get to choose what you feel like or what you want today. Like, um, what's the guy's name? Um, I can't think of the, the little the little guy, man. That's always arguing. Anyway, he was like, gender is a fact, and even Jordan Peterson said it. Gender is a fact. You can't change the gender someone was born. That is a fact. But you know, they go into all of that. But th anyway, the point of this. They're going to put you, because you watch these Israelite videos, because you you click on certain types of videos on, or, or, or TikToks or whatever, they're going to store all that up and share, and then they hear your conversations, you talking, and everything else, and they're going to take all that info, and they're going to categorize you. And we know that word was a, an accuser. Okay, an accuser. Basically going to the father and telling him, like, hey, man, curse them, man. Look, they, they ain't doing what you told them. All right. One uh, against one in the assembly, complainant at law. S especially Satan, accuser. Okay. There you go. All right. And we know this is all going to come down to when they put on the MOTB system, man. When they put that 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 image of the beast is in full effect, man. Your social credit score, your your carbon footprint, all this is going to be on there. The, the the misinformation, conspiracy theory that you believe in, and all of that. How do we know you believe it? Because I watch it. I'm just entertained by it. You could argue, but that's not going to matter. It's still going to put you into a certain category. Some ye yellow list, red list, blue list, black list, something. You've heard of these things before. Okay, and then they're going to know how 
to deal with you from the category that they put you in. All right. And this will go, like I said, into your, if you get that, that, that MOTB chip implant, maybe no, I've said all the wrong shit, but you get that in a, they can categorize what you're liable to do. Okay. Invite in, in, in the adverse as well, all the way down the spectrum. Okay. So just want to put this out there, just something real quick. Um, yeah, we had talked about it and, and it, it, here it go. Like I said, this app, uh, this Google Play Help opened up my pocket. I don't even remember the app. I wasn't looking at a certain app. I just give them the information myself. I mean, some things they'll say, like, they'll, we have we want the ability to go into your pictures and, like, whatever. You, got, you can get it anyway. If it's in this phone, they can get it anyway. They got it already. Okay? just to understand how this thing in Big Brother, so to speak, actually works. Now, what they're going to use it for? Oh, well, man, my faith is bigger than that. All right? But you got to be attending to that faith, man, building it up. So, anyway, Lord willing, this was edifying. Give all praises and glories unto Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shah Bashim, Rakhakudash, double honor to the apostles and the elders and the elder bishops of the great millstone who teach and guide and rule well, and greetings, salutations, blessings, and much love unto you, hopeful elect. To the next one, Shalom.